Assalamu alaikum everyone. This is Rubel. So the last tutorial we run our smoke test and regression test successfully, but we saw the uh, warning by test unknown mark warning. So we are going to resolve this warning uh, today. So we can uh, we can uh, you know resolve this uh, issue temporary from runtime. So let me run again. Uh, I mean, um, if the previous comment I ran and I got that error. So what do you have to do before marker? We have to say disable, hyphen hyphen disable, then hyphen by test, hyphen warnings, warnings. So now if I enter, um, so this error is gone. So that is the temporary solution. So now if I want to permanent, permanent solution, what do you have to do? You have to create one file called PyTest. It has to be PyTest. So PyTest.ini. And here I, uh, I have to say PyTest. And uh, the first we can we we can do filter warning, right? So it's a filter warnings is equal, and we want to ignore everything. Okay, so now if I run, it's just normal. Remove the disable comment. You see, it is uh, so it's ignored. Okay, let me comment out this to make sure we see that error again. So we do see it's error. So now, if I uncomment and run. So it's no error. So this is one way. And another way we can do like, uh, so the this filter warning, it will ignore all the warning, right? But sometimes we do need warning. Um, so we want to specifically uh, disable warning for our SMOC test or regression test, right? So in that case, we can use uh, markers. So markers is equal to like this. So we have a two marker, right? We have a SMOC. And uh, we have regression. So we have uh, these two markers. So we have to make some comments. So this is for a smoke test. And for the regression, say I say this is for regression test. So now, okay, so let me just um, comment out the filter to make sure it is working. You see, no, uh, no warning here. But if I disable again this marker and uh, run again, so you see warning. So this is like the, like three different way we can, um, we can ignore or we can um, we can disable the warning by from the command line, and also we can create a pytest.ini where we can filter all the warning and ignore it, and also we can use the marker to ignore a specific or um, uh, warning. Um, like we have a tag, right? We have a tag on a smoke regression, and we say okay, um, tag related warning should be disabled by. Um, by uh, create a marker under the INA file and mention the tag name and write some comments. Okay, so that's how we can resolve our um, PyTest warning. Thank you.